How do you handle hurt? That's what we've been talking about all week long. And this morning, this morning, I'm only human. Come on, Bishop. I'm only human. What do you expect from me? I've been hurt. And where do I go from there? I'm only human. That's what we're going to talk about this morning. Good morning, Anitra. How are you? We're going to wrap up this week. We've been talking about this week about how do we manage hurt? How do we manage being offended? How do we manage uh, being hurt in situations that it seems as though that it's insurmountable about coming or overcoming the hurt that we've had to deal with? Or how have we hurt others and how do we manage that? That's what we've been talking about all week long. So just want to greet everybody this morning. Good morning, Joelle. Good morning. Uh, good morning, Verena. How are you on this morning? Angela, how are you on this morning? Just want to give you a little bit of review. Now, if this bless you, then bless somebody else. Don't keep it to yourself. Put this in the chat area. You already know the cumulative effect of what we share blesses somebody else later on. Laverne, how are you on this morning? We started out talking about healthy hurt. Then we went to check your spirit. Then we talked about church hurt. And then finally we said play hurt. That's the four things that we've covered. And this morning, this morning, I'm only human. My God, what do you expect of me? Somebody jammed up my feelings. Somebody hurt me to no end. And my response I'm only human. Where do we go from here with this? Good morning, Anna. How are you on this morning? That's what we're going to talk about on this morning. But before we get into that, I want to just share uh, what I'm going to be talking about this coming Sunday. This coming Sunday, please don't forget, uh, 10 o'clock Central Standard Time, New Life, Virtual New Life. You can just connect with us on Virtual New Life, uh, stream with us, Facebook Live, uh, on New Life Tube One. I'm going to be talking about time out. Time out. That's what I'm dealing with. It's our education Sunday, and I got a word for you, and it's going to be talking about time out. Hope you go to somebody's church. What are your plans uh, for this weekend? Thelma, let me get right into the word this morning. This morning, we wrap up the series on hurt. How do I deal with it? The review is this. Healthy hurt. Check your spirit. Church hurt playing hurt. This morning is, I'm only human, Bishop. My God, what do you expect of me? Somebody hurt me. They offended me, and I'm still dealing with it. I'm only human. Here's the text to talk in the takeaway, five minutes or less. Let's get into it. Let's go to work. The text is this, Matthew 7 and 5. Matthew 7 and 5, you already know it well. Hear it again for the first time. You hypocrite. Two faces, that's what it means. You hypocrite. First take the plank out of your eye, and then you will see clearly the speck from your brother's eye. You will see clearly to remove the speck from your brother's eye. Jesus is responding to the Pharisees. He's called them a hypocrite. It comes from the Greek word, and you see this in some theaters where you see a face, a two-faced mask. One is smiling, one is crying. That's where they get that understanding of a hypocrite. You got two faces. <laughs> you got a face for every situation. And Jesus said, look, when you start dealing with trying to come at other people because of what they've done to you, check that. I'm only human. Here's the first thing I want to share with you. The lens. Just the word lens. What lens, what lens are you looking at your hurt? What lens are you looking at? I'm talking about, you know, sometimes people talk about, Bishop, you got a pair of glasses for every uh, thing you got in your wardrobe. Yeah, maybe so, maybe not, whatever. <laughs> okay. But what lens, what lens are you looking at your hurt through? What lens are you looking at it? This connects right to the second thing. When you're dealing with hurt, the lens you look at, make sure you use a mirror. Use a mirror. When looking at others, look at your past discretions. Look at your past discretions. Because of this, when I look at that situation through my lens, my own humanity, the discretions that I have made, maybe I'm not so tough on them. 
but that doesn't remove the feeling that I feel. Am I right about it? I looked through the lens, Bishop. I, I checked out that situation and, and I'm still hurting. I, I looked at the mirror at my own discretions. I looked at them through my humanity, the lens of my own humanity. I looked at myself in my past discretions, but I'm still hurting. What do I do? Or what do I share with someone who's in this situation? The third word I want to share with you is cup. Lens, mirror, cup. Proverbs 25, 21 tells us how to manage it. How to manage it. And this is what he says. Take a cup of cool water to your enemy. And if they're hungry, give them something to eat. This will be like heaping coals on their head. Coals from the fire they're referring to. Heaping coals. And guess what? Here it is. Here is where your healing comes. The Lord will repay you. The Lord will repay you. God will help you deal with that hurt. He will repay you. Proverbs 25, 21. What's your takeaway this morning? Your takeaway is this. Handle hurt with your healthy, with a healthy look at your humanity. And you're only human. And therein lies God helping you through it. He's going to help you through that situation. The Lord be with you today. If face shine upon you, give you peace. Got a word for you this Sunday. Hope you check in and check us out. If not, make sure you go to somebody's church. Watch somebody's church. I'll see you Monday morning with more, mon with more morning manner. God bless you. Share the manner. Don't keep it to yourself. Bye now.